SSI is a services-based company. We have field service engineers living all over the Middle East and in the U.S. primarily servicing x-ray security equipment. So entry control points will have large truck, baggage, personnel, scanning equipment and our guys in the field will install them, maintain them and repair them. When you have personnel coming on and off a post you want to make sure that, that they are secure so they're not carrying explosives or carrying weapons or things like that. I'm a U.S. Air Force veteran. I worked on electrical systems, started out working on these pieces of equipment, and then the end of 2009, my wife and I started SSI to provide people to do same services as what I did. We started in the basement of our home, so as many small businesses, we were worried about mortgage payments, utility bills, and things like that. So to become what SSI has become in such a short amount of time was really not in our vision at the time, but I think the potential was always there. I'm a success. Uh, based on society uh, that I shouldn't be. I'm not a college graduate. Uh, I don't have an MBA. So I think there are people out there that have ideas, they have drive, they have passion, but they need some guidance. My wife and I, we learned most of our lessons the hard way. We, we did a lot of research, we put a lot of time in that uh, if we could help someone get over some of those humps and not have to have so much sweat and blood involved, then that's what we'd like to do. Everything's about security now, and so we're, I think we're right in the prime market for us to succeed. I think we stay in the loop. I think we stay connected. Uh, we find the needs, and I think there's always, for technology, I think there's always going to be a need for people to support it, uh, deploy it. So I, I think SSI stays. My personal advice for someone is that make sure you're passionate about it. Uh, make sure you have the, the attitude, I think, of doing the right thing will, will make you a success and be willing to put in a lot of blood, sweat, and tears. <laughs>